I enjoy shopping at Whole Foods. Regardless if I'm financially struggling or not, I take whatever little bit of money or assistance I get and I make sure that I try to make the most proper uh, health choices that I can make. Why? Because it's now been three to four years, actually been four years since I started this. And I didn't really get fully into it until about a year and a half ago because it took a while to find new products, to learn about ingredients, to learn about cooking, everything else. But something that I have noticed a difference in is people, some of the people that I follow or seen on social media that have similar symptoms and diagnosis as me after four years have their health their um their uh, uh uh environment and everything has gone down the drain you can tell their their physical and mental health have gone down the drain and that's like one of my veteran friends that takes uh medications instead of you know eating healthy or doing anything and those type of uh, terms so the thing is my thing is is that um, is that we can tell a difference and see a difference when somebody is Excuse us, what's going on, bro? not much how you doing um, in in choices that we make in food and and in our environment because also at Whole Foods they have cleaner non-chemical cleaning supplies I also bought one of my shower filters from Whole Foods different things like that so I've been able to even though I haven't cured myself of any disease or problem I have improved the quality of my symptoms limiting the exacerbation it just sucks when you when I don't have the money when I'm actually in a financial bind that I don't have access to my type of water or my type of food and that puts me in the same predicament as somebody that's on medications that obviously my symptoms are going to increase my uh, pain is going to be exacerbated so you know I just hate it because too many people say oh you're struggling you're financially asking for help well, then don't shop at Whole Foods. How about you shop at Winn-Dixie or Walmart? Well, that's not a choice. So. How long is it? They still got the old teas over there. They, they still, they didn't even change. Let me go, I'll be over there. You going to sit Okay. So, Whole Foods, my girl just told me. We came here yesterday and I uh, made a little video clip and pictures that sometimes certain Whole Foods don't move their product around and I have caught them a few different times selling product that is old and leaving it on the shelf. So here's one of them. Today is the 21st of December and they're still trying to sell tea So they're still trying to sell and it's on sale. That it says good through. It doesn't say sell by. It says good through December 17th, which means and it's organic. They should be giving that to the food pantries because those are the people that need it the most. You know what I'm saying? If it's already old, why are you trying to fucking sell it? And if it's a, if, and if it's old, why is it still on the shelf? You should have uh, packaged that up and put, gave it to a food pantry. It's now 4 days old four days old really and you're still trying to sell it just saying I recognize these things but that's all I just wanted to make a short video clip to uh, shut up all the people that run their mouths and say that just because I'm financially struggling I don't deserve the right and the privilege to shop at a place such as Whole Foods but that's completely wrong because of my conditions, because of uh, my family uh, problems. 
you know, it's inevitable and important that I have access to my medication and my medication is eating healthy and doing healthier things and changing my environment. So So that's why. I can't believe there's not even just one thing. All of, like the different flavors I see, every single one of them. I know. But what I was saying on the video is, if this says good through and not sell by, then they should have gave that to a food pantry to people that are because it's the holiday because it's the holiday season. They Who should wants be to pay money for some old ass. Yeah, exactly. They're trying to leave it on the shelf so that somebody ignorant comes along, grabs it off the shelf, and just pays for it until they get home and get pissed off. I mean, whatever. Michael. Michael. That's what people do. There's something over there. There's something. That's where they're supposed Michael. to go. What? What? There's being pushy in there. What? There's being pushy in there. My kitty. Yeah. What? Michael. What? What do you do over there? Did you never You're supposed to eat. Hey. Um, we got four bagels. Ooh, the two packets of matches. No, they're It's got a lot of health stuff in it. The so, one, uh, oh yeah. That's crazy. That's the coffee, the um, housing, and the brain of get paid next time, okay? I didn't get paid yet. But you like it, okay? I know. But it's cool. Put it up there for, for other people. See, now you're touching the floor, see? Put it back up there, I said. Thank you. Oh, okay. So were you gonna use the whole food bag that you were gonna do? Yeah, 
Hey, I was going to cut them apart, he turn them, it up. I was going to cut it out, and then Make the kids turn them inside out, and then cut Make out. them color. That's Make what I was going to say. <laughs> That's what I was going to say. I was going to print out a bunch of holiday magazines. Yeah. Holiday magazines. They can just print yeah, out. Yeah, be creative. Yeah, I'll be <laughs> fine. Yeah. Have a good one. Bye, on. honey. That's another thing I don't like about Whole Foods is stop trying to put fake news everywhere. Why do they always got to play fake news everywhere? The NFL, CNN, look. Nobody wants it. I don't know why Whole Foods, if Whole Foods is trying to be healthy, I don't understand why they promote uh, CNN. They should have Whole Foods things on TV. They should have Whole Foods commercials or uh, Health Food Network. Nobody wants to sit here and watch news. Not at least me. In my generation, I'm 28 years old. I'm a conservative. I am aware and informed about health and nutrition because of my health journey, because of how much I struggled. And for me to want to go to a health a uh, store or a health place and then be forced to watch CNN is kind of like a slap in the face considering that CNN uh, didn't doesn't ever talk about health and nutrition they don't ever promote it they don't ever talk about it if anything they promote and talk about chemicals and poisons and cheap food and discounts and everything else so it kind of it's contradicting to have that on a live stream I know you gotta turn around and then you gotta climb down. Think you can do that? There you go. See, you're a big girl. I told you you could do it. What about Buffalo Bingo Chick-fil-A. Huh? Bingo Chick-fil-A. No, not right now. Super Bowl or when football and basketball. See, I got Why those are Stay with mommy. She's so cute. Thank you. <laughs> How old are you? Four or five? Four. Yep. <laughs> you want to be tall. <laughs> Enjoy every second. There'll be 25 before you know. Yes. Oh, I know. <laughs> Hey, if you like my idea I told you earlier, I'm willing. Oh, goodbye. Goodbye, Whole Foods. <laughs>